uh, what a winner. Shanice Kaysen, I mean, I thought she was a difference in the ball game. I thought Olivia played hard, but Shanice Kaysen, you know, did did some things tonight that we need we've been needing her to do. And on the how many how many rebounds did she get on free throws? But uh, I, I'm really proud of the way our kids uh, came back after what happened the other night. I mean, they were just downtrodden. The coaches was, our fans was. You know, we just couldn't believe that we lost the game after being 19 up and to come in here and play a tough La Tech team. That was uh, that was big. How big was China's three at the end of the first half? Kind of gave you a little momentum, and I thought you maybe rode that in it the. Kept her from getting a a bad chewing, because she had made a couple of, of mistakes there that had kind of gave them some cheap baskets. But she got three of them back right there. So, I I, I got on her a little bit about some of her mistakes there, and then I said, hey. Good job on that three. I appreciate, we appreciate it. Um, in the second half, the run, I think uh, it was maybe a couple of them, 13-2, to two, a couple of 13-2 runs. Did you tell your team anything, or was it just tonight you were making outside shots? We were making know? outside shots, and, we were, and you know, we went to work on the inside. Cheyenne, you know, we're still trying to finesse the ball instead of going up and just grabbing it and, and, and securing it. And uh, she did a better job, but still, we got – you, as you well seen, we played a lot of people. We can play a lot of people. Gabby Lyons, I thought, did a good job early on defensively. Uh, you know, uh, Abby Sism, Bria, China Dow just had tonight was just awesome on the boards. How many boards did she end up with? Six? What what she end up with? Eight. Eight. I mean, you know, that's what we got to have. That makes us a better basketball team. Olivia's going to be okay. I saw she did. Oh the yeah, interview. she was cramping. It was just a just hard, cramps, good, hard, hard, in. hard lick. But she, you know, Olivia Jones is a winner. Did you say anything to Tyler, Coach? I mean, I know you know his family. His mom was up there in the stands. Did you, did you mention anything to him? I, I saw him today changed. and told him he did a great – he was doing a great job. That I would seen his team a month ago, and I thought they were a lot better basketball team right now than they were. Uh, you know, really it was business when we shook hands early on. Afterwards it was business, and uh, we wished each other good luck and went on. But he's got a good team. He's done a good job with that bunch, I'm telling you. A very good job. Rick, did you – would you – and you're, you've known Pat and for a long, long time. And you've since known, 1977. And you've known Tyler since since he was knee high. Would you have ever thought a day would come where you were coaching against him? Mm, I know, you know, you really don't think about that. Probably, you know, just like my son coaching at Ole Miss. Probably, you know, nobody thought that either. But, uh, you know, I, Tyler, he he he's been around the game and. And he's taken a group. He's went under. He's under a lot of pressure. He's Pat Summit's son. I mean, you know, he's under a lot of pressure. He can't not only has to coach his team, but he's got to carry that around too. And he's proud of it. But there's everybody thinks, you know, that I guess that he's supposed to win every game, and he's under a lot of pressure. And uh, I feel for him. And uh, you know, uh, but he's done a great job. I'm telling you, I I, I watched his team a month ago, and. Uh, I wasn't real impressed, and then I started watching them about two weeks ago, and I thought, goodness gracious, this ain't the same basketball team. They defend, they rebound, they shoot the ball, they do everything well. I mean, they're going to be in the mix. You can count them. They're going to be in the mix at the end of the year. Did you see any similarities in what you saw, what you saw the progression that was like his mother when she you – no. I mean, or is it his, has he developed from what you've seen develop his own style? You know – and I, don't take me wrong because Tyler's got some good players and I've got some good players. But Pat Summit had the best players in the world. <laughs> so, no, I didn't see any similarities. I was glad I didn't – I'm glad I wasn't playing Candace Parker out there tonight or, or, or uh, Nikki Anasicki and those people, you know. The, when you went in to play them up there, that's who you were playing. You were playing eight or nine or ten. WBCA All Americans, you know, and uh, Tyler's got a good team, just like we got a good team. And you know, uh, I I would say he would like to go back and start his season over, with what way they're playing right now. And I would too. I'd like to go back and start our season over, with who we got. You know. Do you expect them to? I mean, maybe be a team that you see in the semifinals. Don't think something? there's any doubt about it. Don't think there's any doubt about it. I think they're going to be in the mix. I've, I've seen everybody on TV, and we played most of them, or played at least what? How I many? Five of them, or six of them? Five. And uh, you know, in watching film on other teams, I've seen those teams. I think La Tech is uh, is is got a good basketball team.